Okay, so it's time for my hair update, my braids update. So I'm gonna to talk to you about how I've, like what I've been doing with my hair and um, how many times I washed it um, and, um, you know, redoing it. Me, I'm keeping mine in for seven months until I have my baby, which is gonna be in the next six months from now. So I've had these in. Oh, okay, so I've had these braids in my hair since um, the ending of November. And since then, I've gotten like a lot, a good amount of new growth for me to, you know, re to take it, re not redo it, but touch it up. So, the amount that I'm gonna touch up isn't gonna be a lot at all, but it's gonna look, when I'm done, it's gonna look like, you know, I did my whole entire head over when I really didn't. Okay, so let me give you a close up of what it looks like and explain to you when you really, 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 really girl need to take your braids out. Like, um, I have some that's really bad, that's really hanging from a strand. Oh, let me see if I can see it better if I look in a mirror. Okay, so, okay, here's a good example. So, <laughs> If, you, if your hair isn't natural, me, I'm natural. It, it, you know, it's fine. I mean, it, there's still a high chance of this popping off, depending on how I take care of it. But I, me, I just keep it in a ponytail. I just keep mine back nice and neat. I don't, I don't um, force it into a tight ponytail or nothing like that. If the ponytail is tight, I'm pulling some of the braids forward to loosen that, that ponytail up. That way this these aren't pulling all the way back so this right here is a big no-no you want to take these out even if you can't get a touch up with whoever is doing your hair if you're doing it you want to take them out because um, especially if your hair is relaxed and not natural because I remember I learned my lesson <clears throat> way way back in 2000 I want to say maybe 2005, 2006, where I used to relax my hair and um, I was like, I just didn't feel like taking it out, you know? I didn't want to take it out, I didn't want to redo it. But what happened was, um, I moved it a certain way and it just came completely off from all of this. I lost all of that is what I lost when it came off. So if you don't want to lose all of that, uh, take it out. Don't, don't, don't let them hang like this. Especially if you're wearing it down. Especially if you have um, young children and they're always on you. They can accidentally grab this thing and it can come right out. Even, you know, with my hair being natural and me having a young child, I'm still afraid that she can just snatch this out. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take out, I'm going to take it out and then I'm going to wash it. And then... I'm going to show you how I take out my braids and then I'm going to show you, you know, how I wash it, what I use. And then um, I'll have another video showing you, um, you know, how much I'm rebraiding and the process of me rebraiding it. And then I'll have a third video of me actually styling it because I want to see, um, I'm going to test out how this hair is going to curl. So I'm going to curl it with some some flexi rods. So if you guys, um, if you want to see part two and three, make sure you subscribe and you hit the bell button so that you can be notified when those other two videos come out. Okay, so I'm gonna take out, let me push this back. <clears throat> I'm gonna take out this.
What you want to take out is all around your edges. And it really depends on who's um, touching it up for you because I know me, I, I charge by the amount. So depending on the amount that that person is charging for, that's how much you want to take out. But you know, at least the most important part, which is your edges. And then the back part is what, for me, the, the my back section from experience, from wearing braids myself, that's what um, gets locked up and, and dread. Because I remember uh, many years ago, I did have braids and I left them in for six months. I don't remember how I maintained it, but I don't think I did a good job at maintaining it because it locked up. It really, really locked up. But I was able to comb it out without, um, without losing my hair. Okay. Okay, so this is all of what I'm gonna take out and redo. And since I've had this in, I believe I washed and conditioned it like twice, just twice, I think. <clears throat> okay, here we go, take out. Now, if you have braids as small as mine, um, Using something really fine like this is really helpful and save a lot of time. Or you can use like one of those one of those um, curved sewing needles. That's my favorite. Good <clears throat> So let me just cut it. Hi, Mom. Say hi. Hi. How are you? Count for them. One. Okay, eat your food. <laughs> okay. Mommy. Mommy. No, you eat it. Mommy. You eat it. Mommy don't want it. Mommy. Mommy. You eat it. Mommy. I wish I could do all. Are you going to cut all of it? No.
Okay. Let's see how much hair I lose. Let's see how bald I become. For those of you in the comment section crying about, oh, this person is gonna be bald headed and that person is gonna be bald headed and all of her clients are bald. Let's see how bald headed I become after taking these out. This story takes place in the boys' room. This room is the You read the story. I need help. Go back, look, find the question in the story. They didn't place in the story. Where, what is, what's the question? The, the boy, wait, hold on. This story takes place in the boys' room. This room is the... <clears throat> so I'm just separating my hair from the the gulp, the, what do you call it? I guess the... The gulp? All that build up dirt and that's about all that I have no hair just build up sweat and hair products and what yes. yeah you can say hi you can come right here and say hi hi <laughs> They, they'll, they know. They seen you in my video. <laughs> okay, so this half is out. And now it's time to do this half.
to sing a song with Penny. Say well done to Penny. Saying well done is really nice to do. Great. Okay, pull your pants down. You poop? No, I gotta take your shoes off. I gotta take your shoes off. I'll, I'll do it. Wait, wait, Alani, wait. Okay, so that's all that I'm gonna be. Um, that's all that I'm gonna take out to redo. And next, I'm going to show you guys how I shampoo and condition uh, my braids. So remember to subscribe if you aren't subscribed, so that you'll be notified and updated about that video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Enjoy. I hope that it was helpful and um, if you guys have any questions go ahead and leave it in the comment section below and I'll try my best to answer all of your questions.